Open the lobster clasp and unhook the lead from the collar. This will make it easier to put the collar on the dog. Undo the collar by sliding the jump ring back off the end of the leather. Gently pull the leather end out from the fixed jump ring, being careful not to lose the fitting. First, we'll run through doing the collar up without putting it on our dog. Take the pointed leather end and feed it through the fixed jump ring. Adjust the fit by pulling more or less through. When happy with the fit, Fold the pointed leather end back on itself and through the other jump ring. Make sure to slide the jump ring far enough along to prevent it from accidentally coming undone. Now we will fit the collar onto the dog, following the same steps. Make sure that before you fit the collar, it is up the right way. We don't want to put it on, only to find his tag is reversed. Wrap the collar around the dog's neck and feed the pointed leather end through the fixed jump ring. Fold the pointed leather end back on itself and through the other jump ring. This is the fiddly bit. You want to pull the jump ring backwards over the pointed leather end. Once on, the collar should stay in place. The lead can then be attached or detached without the need to remove the dog's collar. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please visit my shop for a variety of handmade miniatures. You can follow me on Instagram, Facebook or Pinterest and find tutorials and more on my blog. Links are in the description below. Thanks for watching.